Merry Christmas and Happy Holidays! Before I start, I just want to introduce some guests. We have my sister who's sitting right there. I think she's just going to chill there. Also, we have Mickey Gutierrez! Yes! Check out this sweater. I got it from Target. And I have the matching jacket for humans. Anyways, in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys what I got my friends and family for Christmas and also wrapping the gifts. First, I'm going to show you what I'll be wrapping with. First, I got this cute mini gift wrap from the Target dollar section. The only con to it is that in the inside, I didn't realize it doesn't have like the measuring grid. I got this bigger wrapping paper. It is like Santa and Moose. We got the tape, Sharpie, and these like name tags I found in the closet. First, we're gonna start off with family gifts. So first, from my little cousins from that Clovis vlog, we have cousin number one, the oldest. My mom just has a bunch of like random Christmas cards stocked up, so I just picked one. Here's the inside. Anyways, the most important part is what we put in this card, which is this, a Nintendo eShop credit. When I asked cousin number one what she wanted for Christmas, she said that she just wanted the Animal Crossing DLC, which, side note, I've been loving. I've been living out like my Sims home decor career. And I feel like the DLC, it really extends like the lifetime of the Animal Crossing game. Next up, we have cousin number two, who is the sibling of cousin number one, except he's younger. And me and my sister, we got him this Space Jams Connect 4, except it's coming in tomorrow, so I can't show it, but I'll show a picture. He likes Space Jams. I think they all like Space Jams, actually. My sister said that she's played the Connect 4 like, like there's like a shooting element to it and she said it was fun. And for cousin number three, the youngest of the three kids, who is also my goddaughter, we got her this LOL doll thing. When we last saw them, she was playing with these dolls. You definitely do see like that baby doll. Um, but it says 25 surprises. It's a big box, so I don't really know what else could be in here. Maybe clothes, accessories? I don't really know. I'm gonna wrap this. So moving on now to my immediate family. I bought these like a month or two ago from TJ Maxx when we were there because I was just strolling around. There's a third one, but I already gave it to Mickey. But I guess this will count as his Christmas present. I'm not going to wrap these, these because uh, it's for a dog. <laughs> Maybe we can give one to Mickey right now. I think he likes it. For my dad, we got him these earbuds from Costco. They were on sale for Black Friday. And you know, we are a Costco family. So of course we had to take advantage of this deal. Once we bought it, he already started using it. So I can't really show it, but I think he likes it. For my mom, I have these two boxes right here. So this is a rapid egg cooker. <laughs> I think it's very clear you could tell which of her daughters picked this for her. Because my sister loves eggs. It's really cute though. I really like the yellow color. Okay, and then there's this bigger box. So this is 
An electric indoor grill with a glass lid. Our neighbor, they have something similar to this and I feel like we've been jealous of them because they get to make KBBQ from their houses, which sounds amazing. Also on the back, they have other foods that they have displayed. So I guess you could cook other foods in here too. Both of these are squares, so it'll be a piece of cake to wrap. Your gift. <laughs> oh no, but we keep finding lying down here. That's so hard. My sister's gone now, so we can get started. It is a stylus. It's just like for her iPad. I think it comes with two of them. But it's because she sent her a list that, you know, she's a teacher, if you didn't know. And she says that she loses them a lot. I got her a pencil sharpener. In her list, she said, you know, she's a teacher. She needs a lot of pencil sharpeners. This was from Amazon. Next, I got her these, like, K-pop photo card albums. I got it from Etsy. This one's like flowers that has a heart hole and then in the inside it has like these paper protectors or whatever where you can put in your photo cards and then put it into the binder. Anyone who knows my sister knows she loves K-pop and BTS so this is great for her. I also got this other color it's like a blue butterfly one. So I think we actually have like every part of her personality. The K-pop, the teacher, and now these, the Animal Crossing. She has these Sanrio Amiibos that she bought a while ago and she let me borrow them. However, I accidentally lost two of them. So I told her about that and she was just like, oh, it's okay, you can buy me some replacements. I got these from Etsy. Lately, I've been really loving Etsy. I think I mentioned this last year too, but I really like Etsy because it has more of that small business feel to it. If you don't know what an amiibo is, it's basically like if you have it, you can scan these characters into Animal Crossing. Here's what she wanted from her list, Friga, who is the hamburger sheep. Jay. We used to have Animal Crossing on the Wii, and I believe Jay was one of the characters that we had. Marshall, Dom, and then one of the new villagers, Io. Lastly, with her gift, I was really excited because she put this on her list. She wanted a phone charm, basically like, like this. I decided on this one. It has like stars, flowers, butterflies. I feel like my sister really likes colorful stuff, so I thought it would be good for her. It's from the Etsy store, Lindsay's Boutique. It also came with this cute ring, which I'm not sure if she'll use it or not, but that's still really nice as a freebie. I really don't know if she's gonna like this. Hopefully she does, but if not, then oh well. Alex did mention that he wanted a speaker a while ago, so I was like, okay, I'll just get him a speaker. I got it from Amazon, and it was on sale because it was Black Friday. We already exchanged gifts, so I can only insert a picture. Anyways, I do have a funny story to go with this. In the past, Alex, whenever I give him a gift, there's been times like he accidentally buys the gift that I got him before we exchange gifts. What's up with that? <laughs> yeah, like one time I got him these like Adidas shoes that he was like had his eye on. And then like a couple days later, he was like, Oh, guess what? I bought the shoes. When I already bought the shoes. And then last year, I got him like this green long sleeve shirt. And then he got a shirt that's like a similar one from Uniqlo! So anyways, like a week or two ago, me and Alex were at Marshall's. You know when you check out, there's all like these cool stuff that they put near the checkout line to make you buy stuff. Anyways, there was a speaker there and Alex was about to buy it! But luckily, I was like, Oh, is that a good brand though? And 
luckily he didn't buy it. I was really panicking in that moment in Marshall's so though. I was just like, please don't buy that speaker. Please don't buy that speaker. The next section, which is friends gifts. And please stay till the end because I really think I saved the best gift for last. Anywho, this is Elizabeth's and then afterwards I'll do Guadalupe's gifts. They are my middle school friends. Elizabeth, she's really into nail polish. When you go into her room, it's low-key kind of like a nail salon. because She has a lot. Anyway, so I got her nail polish from our fave brand, Ella and Mila. They were doing a Black Friday sale, so it was like buy three, get two free. I continued with my generous mood and I just got all five for her. She had a lot of colors that she wanted. I actually went through and kind of tried to pick colors that went together. So the color palette is kind of like this pinky purpley palette. This color, this one, this one. There's like a stripe of blue in there. I don't really know what happened. I think maybe you need to shake it. This one, which is more of like a bubblegum pink. I actually think I have this color. Lastly, we have this one. That is the only like sparkly one. In the spirit of her, I'm going to individually wrap every single one of these because to side with her, I guess it is more exciting because you have more stuff to open. And luckily, I kept all of like my little scraps from wrapping thus far. So these will definitely come in handy. So for Guadalupe, I got her two things. Every year, she always asks for this re-rate dog's calendar. I really don't know why she likes it. I mean, I guess it's appealing because it's dogs. Secondly, I got her this game. I would say in the recent years, our friend group, we really bonded together with board games and just games. So I saw there was a game on her list and I got it because I wanted to play it. So it's called Buzz. Anyone who knows Guadalupe knows that this is Guadalupe in a game. Here, let me read some of the examples in the back. Drink if you peed since the game started. All players who are using someone else's Netflix account must drink. Which player can guess the time most accurately? The winner gives out a drink. I wrapped the gift, it looked good. This bag, it says, well, apparently you made the good list this year. The aesthetic is pretty ugly and that's why I'll give it to Guadalupe. Perfect. And now the last person, Leslie. As I said, I feel like I saved the best for last, but I feel like it's a lot. One, because she's a December baby, so one of these is her birthday present, the other one's a Christmas present. Secondly, I remember last Christmas, her gift was extremely generous to me. I'll start off with her birthday gift. First, I got her this BT21 neck pillow. Like It goes like this, and there's like a hood. BT21, it's like the BTS. They're cartoons. I really don't know which one was her favorite one, so I just picked this koala, Koya, because it's RM's cartoon and her bias is RM. It's very soft. I wish you could feel it. Next, we have this box. I'll say this is now the start of her Christmas gift. I asked her like, oh, do you want anything else? And she said socks. So I did get her socks, this gift card to that poke place in Weberstown Mall because she goes there sometimes. And I also got her a candle. It was really hard to brainstorm for Leslie because Leslie, as I mentioned, she is a BTS army, but everything that she wants, 
she's already bought. <laughs> it makes it very challenging because it's like, what other BTS item do you not have? Anyway, so I searched Etsy. I found this candle. This smells like RM. I thought it was kind of funny, but I think it's also a good gift because Leslie is a very hardworking gal. She deserves to light a candle and relax at home and smell RM. If you thought that was the last of it, it's not. There's one last thing. Me and Alex, we are shopping at H Mart the Korean market in San Jose and I stumbled across this and I was like Haha, <laughs> that would be so funny to get Let's BT21 toilet paper It's like imprinted in little designs I think this is hilarious I know for sure she doesn't have this Now I'm gonna wrap And the Christmas wrapping is a success! <laughs> Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays. Be sure to look out for my next video, what I got for Christmas. Thanks for watching and I shall see you next time. Goodbye!